Hello everyone, it's Exo Man, and I'm here with the lovely farm. Group. Hi everyone! And uh, today, I want to demonstrate something for you. What I want to show you, well, it has to do with leverage. Leverage, say, how, what leverage did I use, for example, to become friends with this lovely lady? <laughs> What did I leverage? My money or my good looks? You used or? something like this. It was like a sledgehammer, I think. I used the pry bar. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to, to get her out of her car and into my... Anyway, never mind all that. Mm. So what this is, this tool that I'm demonstrating, that she's... Farm Girl's going to help me demonstrate. It's called a post hole digger tamp bar. Tamping. Tamping, sorry. <laughs> Thank you for correcting me. Tamp. And... Farm girl has promised me that she's not going to clip a toe off. <laughs> Do I trust you? Yeah, it's not right. in my plans. So, leverage is everything. Ask an old timer. All right. So, what the, the beauty of something like this is the weight of it. Yeah. Okay. So, this is designed. I'm not actually sure what that, that what the spade end is designed for. But this end is obviously for tamping around your post hole to push to slam your dirt back into the ground to tighten up the earth. But we're going to show you today how you can remove a section of root. You're going to widen your stance and promise me that you're not going <laughs> to hit a, hit a foot. She's, she's not. Um, so look at that. The sheer weight and force will cut right through a live oak. Red oak root. This is a wow. Yeah, be really careful when you pull it up. Now, if she had on leather boots, it wouldn't make much difference with the weight of this thing. So, hold your comments, people. All you safety nicks. All right, go ahead and go ahead and run. <laughs> but but so this is a drain field for a septic system right here, and I'm always out here hacking roots apart. So. Now, if you're digging a post hole and say you get say you get down a, a foot or so and you and keep your stance wide, yeah, and you've got a root down there. Well, look at this. You can just use the weight of this tool to go down into your post hole and chop a root out. If you can hit the root, okay. Now you won't look as good doing this as Farm Girl does. Oh God! <laughs> Unless you're Raquel Welch. I know it's not pretty. <laughs> it's pretty to me. Aww. Surprising, but you actually look good to me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess I'm not there right, yet. Now you, now you show me doing it. Let's see, let's see what it looks like with a guy doing it. <laughs> now my it's shoes. It's much faster. My, yeah, I have my toes covered, but they're actually no, no more protective than hers because this is a heavy tool. Now watch this. I'm through that section. You can see if you were through here. Yep, moving. So, you can do this with a saw, but if you use a saw, you're gonna dull your blade in the earth, right? Right, and so, I was thinking it's really too far down to use an axe. I mean, you could, but yeah, I've done, I've used axes before, but it's a lot easier with this weight because you've got it. It's it's tubular. It's this big, strong, monolithic blade coming down on your butt here. Mister, look at that. Awesome! Isn't that amazing? That's so now, say useful. you've dug your post hole and you've got loose dirt, to use this to pack your dirt, to tamp your post hole. You can also use this, come over here. Hey, Papa. If you've got these really hey, big stubborn iron weeds, or whatever you might call them, you can drive that down in there and lift that whole stubborn thing up with well, great ease. See that? Nice. Make sure we didn't leave any room in there. 
The flying teeth are out. Yeah, they're awful. So, and then say you're removing tile from your floor. I'm trying to scrape something up. Oh. A lot of, that's a lot of weight and a lot of power. This thing is 16 pounds. Yep. And you can also get these tamping tools with a point on the end. Uh, say. Wait, so, what's 16 pounds? This is 16 oh. pounds. Oh, yeah. Feels heavier now, than that. Feel it. It feels heavier than 16 pounds. Does it? Yeah. Now, <laughs> say if you're. Uh, if you're doing some demolition and you're trying to remove a post and it's got a concrete ball on it down in the earth uh -huh. You can use something like that to break break, that up. break up the concrete. They make one with a point on the end So you can there's so much force. Yeah. in that point it's when amazing it how much power comes down there. on concrete All right, so there you go. There's your your post hole digger tamping tool How-to video. I hope Very this helps and just imagine all the things that you can do with this device. <laughs> Have it right next to your crowbar. All right. <laughs> Now, if you do this at home and you're not a stunt girl like Farm Girl is, be sure to wear your steel toe boots. Be careful, people. It's so easy that a 60-year-old farm girl can do it. 60? 52? 53. 53. <laughs> it's so I, easy that a 53-year-old farm girl can do it. <laughs> I forget. <laughs> so, um, yeah. Anyway, we're, we're, we're chilling out now after all that hard work. And uh, thank you for watching, everyone. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching, everyone. Hope this helps.